What I think Nokia can do and why we're here uh, is that we bring a unique perspective to public safety. We've, we've been within the Verizon network for a long time. We see the evolution of 4G to 5G as an enabler for public safety and, and to, to bring assets to public safety like reducing response time, saving lives and those types of things just due to the nature of, of how we architect our solution, how we distribute our solution and we drive towards the use cases that bring benefits to public Public safety things like being able to transport massive amounts of video to allow responders to communicate device to device and device to network bringing distributed cloud applications to allow uh, first responders to, to use low latency applications to control devices at the edge of the network to hit that first cloud pop within the network to to allow again that device to device very low latency communication and back into the network and then to wrap that all together Together into an integrated operations center where the, the, the first responders have a clear view of everything that's happening pre-event and post-event. So you can prepare for the event and try to anticipate if events are going to happen. And once events happen, to quickly react to what is the best solution for that event based on those applications and have the ability to spin those applications up in a geography where they're required. You don't need the application to sit there all the time and consume resources. Once an event happens, Verizon will have the ability through the Nokia solution to spin up that application where it's required, use it for the extent of time that the first responders need it, and then spin that, that application back down and free up those resources for something else within the network. So I think that's why Nokia is uniquely positioned because we understand that end-to-end -end holistic approach to, to what first responders need.